Hi, I'm back in Glasgow Airport. That's your Transac flight that I'll be taking back to Toronto. Just a couple of closing thoughts about coming over here to Glasgow. Um, if you want to get around Glasgow easily, uh, buy a card for the subway. And it costs three pounds for the card and then you load it up from there. Uh, you can use this anytime and continue to load it up. Take it home with you, do not throw it away uh, because when you come back the next time you can continue to use it. So that's great value for money. You get a reduction uh, for buying and using the card f than from paying uh, as you go. So it's a good idea. Um, so as for the weather, uh, what you see out there is basically how it's been for the last 10 days. Now, Everyone has told us from Glasgow all the way up to Oban and Tobin Mori that you should have been here two weeks ago because the weather was fabulous. However, uh, yeah, there was a couple of days when the sun did break out and that was great. Sat around in a friend's garden and enjoyed the sun. Um, so, you know, when you're here, as you may have seen from one of my earlier videos that we went to the Duck Bay Marina down at Loch Lomond. It's only a 40, 45 minute drive from, from Glasgow and uh, it's basically that way uh, to Loch Lomond and uh, uh, it's very pleasant out there. Uh, you can have lunch, dinner, sit outside, enjoy the view of of uh, Ben Nevis and, or Ben Lomond, sorry, and uh, uh, watch for the float plane taking off and landing. So we'll just go over the other side here and get a better view of what's happening in the city from here. Uh, so over there is the, the Campsie Hills which are on the north side of the river and uh, in that general direction there is downtown Glasgow. Uh, there's many ways that you can get into Glasgow. Uh, you can take a bus into the city centre. You can find the information downstairs in the arrival area. Uh, you can get an Uber um, or a taxi. I, I would go for the Uber. So load up that app before you come over and tell the driver to meet you uh, at the entrance uh, to the airport rather than in the pickup points inside because they charge you two pound because he has to go through the barrier uh, for a couple of minutes and that's two pound added on to uh, your ride but listen when you get off a plane after seven or eight ten hours uh, you want a bit of comfort so pick up early and off you go now we stayed at an airbnb on the south side of the city you can see it on an earlier video and we stayed in a two-bedroom apartment. There were three of us. It was very comfortable. It had all the amenities that, re that we required. And we walked across the bridge into the city centre, into the shopping area, bars, restaurants. And, you know, in some places, you, if you're into beer, you can get a pint for a couple of pound, maybe three pound, and that equates to about seven dollars uh, when we were up in Oban uh, and and told but primarily Oban if you went into Weatherspoons for dinner they've got great deals for dinner in there and you can get a pint of beer for a pound 99 so if you're a beer drinker that's certainly the way to go now if you look at what I'm wearing uh, I've got a t-shirt uh, I've got a hoodie and I've got a windbreaker uh, and a cap and that's what you need uh, for travelling around Scotland at this time of year because it does rain a lot off and on and you just want to be comfortable if you have something that will shed water that's excellent and a change of shoes, waterproof shoes are recommended and change of socks uh, so that your, your feet are comfortable a couple of other things uh, Wi-Fi can be awful here uh, I've tried numerous times to load videos to no avail in different locations. Um, most places provide Wi-Fi, but 
don't have the bandwidth uh, offered uh, to load videos. So you can get your email, post messages, but that's about it. So that's a better view of Glasgow there on the north side. And uh, one thing you must remember when you come over here is A, put your cell phone on airplane mode, airplane mode as soon as you board the plane. And secondly, purchase a little Samsung or if you have an old uh, one piece uh, basic cell phone, bring that and you can load up a SIM card uh, from any news agent around Glasgow and they'll sort you out for it no problem that will enable you to at least make a telephone call and send a text message uh, but as i said uh, most places are pretty limited in terms of uh, wi-fi and the ability to load up videos So uh, I hope you've enjoyed this little tour of uh, Glasgow and the west of Scotland and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye for now.